How is it going guys? Welcome back to Coinhouse. Today I'm going to show you these beautiful coins I bought from local coin shop in Baku. For a whole grab I paid nearly $33. Among them you'll see old coins, modern coins, proof coins, brilliant uncirculated coins and even one medieval coin struck during Shirvan Shah dynasty in 16th century. So without further much ado, let's see what we have here. As you can see mostly they are inside holders. Starting with this 2006 one euro cent from Italy with, with Castle de Monter reverse. A splendid peach orange coin with random carbon explosions on both surfaces. Strike is sharp. Next comes is about uncirculated 2011 10 euro cent from Estonia. Relatively lower mintage coin. Only 30 million examples were struck for circulation in whole Eurozone area. As always, I tend to buy Elizabeth II coins from Commonwealth countries, especially the UK. This is 1967 red brown one penny from United Kingdom. It displays strong traits of mint luster. It pretty looks like uncirculated coin to me, as I don't see any mentionable contact marks here. This is 2002 brilliant uncirculated 20 euro cent from Greek euro mint set. Almost like a new. Here is medieval Shirvanshah's coin I was talking about, with the nomination of one tenge. Coin was struck during the reign of Shirvanshah dynasty, to be exact, the Khalilullah II, Turkish or for grammatic correctness, Turkic Muslim leader of the Shirvan state located in current Azerbaijani territory. Year of impression is 1532 and content of metals pure silver. Coins at very good condition. Next coins we have inside bag are from Germany, 1951 Deutschmark. one Deutschmark. one Deutschmark. This has some olive green patina under the right pole of eagle. Nineteen fifty five Deutschmark This one has very peculiar gouging, some of them crisscrossing on device elements. I'm not sure whether these are traits of some mint error. Also it shows massive nick on southwestern rim. In 1989, J50 Fennec was very charming of worst design. Coin is it about uncirculated condition. This is relatively old German coin, 1924, 5 Renton Fennec struck in Berlin. Aluminium bronze coin with mintage of less than 40 million for Berlin mint. At means day 65, these coins are worth at least $22. Unfortunately, I bought only two US coins this time. Both of them circulated Lincoln cents. First one, 1994 D. other 1989D. These Denver struck pennies are at extremely fine condition. Next bags, Euro coins from mint sets.
2000 to 20 euro cent from Portugal. Strike and preservation is perfect. Coin should be at least a 65 or 66. Moving on to this 2001 Netherlands bimetallic 1 euro coin, featuring a little bit abstract portrait of Queen Beatrix. It has very cool contrast between inner and outer circle. And this 2002 50 euro cent from Austrian mint set. And for the last, the cherry of the pie, Australian Elizabeth II proof coin from 1984. It comes encapsulated and provided with this informative label. It says 1984 $1 proof. First year of issue. Here they explain what's depicted on obverse and reverse, and all the back main features of the coin. Content of alloy, weight, diameter, and method of edge milling. Outstanding coin with incredible mirror-like fields that contrast with golden-like device elements and letterings. By the way, if read from the list, metal composition is aluminum bronze, so no silver or gold here. It features cameo reflectivity on both sides, just splendid. Thanks for watching guys, let me remind you once again, for all these coins I paid nearly $33. Hope you enjoyed the video, if you did, please hit thumbs up below to help us promote our videos. See you in the next episode.